Hey, y'all. Welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time visiting, welcome. Please be sure to look at the other content. If you enjoy the other content, please like the content and also subscribe to my channel. Hit that bell button so that you can be notified of whenever we post new content. We have a Facebook group, Craftable Things. Please join us on Facebook. And I recently started a new channel, Teach Craft Live. I would love for y'all all to come over there too. For my returning subscribers, welcome back. Today's video is going to be super, super quick. So I was in Michael's and I will have a haul video posted on Teach Craft Live. But I was in Michael's and I saw that Michael's have, they have new tumblers um, and they have the regular stainless steel, they have tumblers that come in black and they have these white tumblers. So. For my vinyl epoxy crew, they have new things for you. But for this one, I just want to test this out and see if we can actually sublimate onto this cup. Uh, I tried to look at the details about the cup, but it didn't really tell us. So I'm going to simply put an image on there and put it in my convection oven for about maybe about six minutes may or less and see if that will work um, I will look at it just to make sure just to see if that image comes through but I'm hoping that it works who knows we won't know unless we try it out so let's get started y'all so I'm just going to put this image on here I should have curved it because this cup is tapered however i i just want to test it out if this does not work i am going to glitter and epoxy this baby okay so we are just going to tape it down with some heat tape typically i would put shrink wrap around it to kind of make it very very tight I don't know yet if I'm gonna do that. But just make sure you have it where it's making contact, good contact with the cup. So I am going to quickly heat wrap this and we're gonna place it into the oven and see if it works. All right guys, so I almost forgot to start recording, but we are going to remove the shrink wrap from here, you can see the logo faintly through, um, but I don't know if it's just because the paper is kind of thin and you can see it. So we will see now. I baked this for six minutes inside of the convection oven. All right, so we will see. Oh, we do have a transfer on here, y'all. It's kind of light, so I'm thinking that maybe it's not too light, but it's way better than I expected, actually. So it could be the time, and it looks like a lot of the ink is off of the paper. So I'm thinking that I want to get another one of these cups and try it with my um with the other paper and see how that prints out but mm, i'm surprised it actually went on and this is the ink not much ink is left onto the paper so now i'm even more curious as to sublimating onto these cups from Michaels. Mm. Thinking the timing, maybe I should have shouldn't have kept it in for six minutes. I don't know, but y'all we we have a transfer. 
All right, y'all. So we are done with testing the Michael's cup to see whether or not it can be sublimated on. I really want to test this out a little bit more. It actually looks pretty good. It's more uh, so kind of like a matte look. But I'm thinking that, one, I could have possibly had it in the convection oven for too long. Or I may want to try another um, paper. I don't know, but I, I just want to test it out, change the timing with cooking it. Like, I really want to to test it out a little bit more because I am actually impressed. This is, I did not think that it was going to even get any ink onto it. I put this in the convection oven for about six minutes at 400 degrees and I am going to probably get a few more of these cups just to test it out to see. I like this style cup. They have these at Michael's for about $7.99 and I use my teacher discount or I think I use a teacher discount and the 20% off discount but one probably only took really. So yeah. All right. So if you all enjoyed this video, please be sure to like the video. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. But I just intended for this to be a super quick video just to see if it can be done. So that's it for today. Thank you all so much for watching. Until next time.